All right, Allison, thanks. Well, Bakersfield College student Jose Bayo transforming into a local activist after being detained by ICE for the second time in the past year back in April. Bayo's story sparking conversations across the country after two NFL players helped him bail out in August. Now, Bayo, along with other BC students, are bringing that conversation to the forefront locally. 23 ABC's Emma Lockhart has more on the social justice forum set to take place at Bakersfield College on Tuesday and how you can get involved. Emma? Jess, organizers of the first Dear America Social Justice Conversation Conference tell me the event aims at creating a diverse not only about immigration, but other social issues as well. Bayo spearheading the event following injustices he says he faced after being detained by ICE hours after he recited a poem at the Truth Act Forum, a poem where he criticized Trump-era immigration policies. We want to feel safe whether we're brown, Asian, or black. We don't want your jobs. We don't want your money. We're here to work hard, pay taxes, and study. Those are the words of undocumented immigrant and Bakersfield College student Jose Bayo. Words from a poem he recited at the Truth Act Forum, hosted by KCSO in April. 36 hours later, he was detained by ICE for the second time this year. The move sparking outrage from some, most notably Demario Davis of the New Orleans Saints and Josh Norman of the Washington Redskins, who helped post his $50,000 bond in August. The NFL players are part of the Players Coalition, a group of athletes fighting for social justice reform. Now, months later, Bayo is turning his gratitude into activism as he believes his rights were violated by ICE. Bayo, along with other BC students, are spearheading the first Dear America, a social justice conversation conference at Bakersfield College Tuesday. BC adjunct professor Ian Anderson helping those students lead the charge. It's important to use this kind of a platform to be able to bring those topics to light in a very low-key, casual kind of way. The idea of this is really a coffee conversation. Demario and Norman will be at the event speaking about how to improve social justice and and racial equality. Part of the goal of having the NFL players there is to kind of show that anybody and everybody cares about this topic and that we want to bring people together to really just kind of address that. Anderson says the topic will go beyond just immigration, touching upon the injustices among the LGBTQ community, women and African Americans. Bayo hoping the first open discussion acts as a catalyst sparking an even bigger conversation beyond the event. This is a really great opportunity for students and young people to get involved. We have election year coming up, so getting involved and knowing what's going on in your community is really important. And I think now, I says Jose Bayo entered the country illegally, and after he was detained the first time, they said he had known gang ties. Bayo disputes that and says ICE had the wrong person. Now, the event is taking place on BC's campus uh, from 9 a.m. until 8 p.m. However, the event is sold out. Reporting in studio, Emma Lockhart, 23 ABC, connecting you.